Today is Friday and it concludes week two of the Lenten Prayer Project at Aldersgate. By now, I hope that you have picked up your prayer cards. They are located in the white bin outside the fellowship hall, or you can pick them up as you come into worship on Sundays. These packets contain um, all five of the prayers that will be used in our Lenten project. Excuse me, there are six of them. <laughs> they contain all six of the prayers. And it also includes a copy of the mission statement. On Fridays and through the weekend, we invite you to come to the DC and right in front of the DC, there is the labyrinth. We invite you to take your prayer cards and walk the circular path to the center of the labyrinth with Jesus. Stop where you need to stop, listen where you need to listen, sit or stand or walk faster. Whatever it is that you are feeling, let Jesus guide you to the center of his heart as you journey toward the center of the labyrinth. And today, we invite you to pray the prayer of Jabez as you walk. We also invite you to pray over the Aldersgate mission statement. In the next three years, Aldersgate United Methodist Church will focus on relational paths of discipleship that build and enrich a multi-generate, excuse me, a multi-generational church. So when we are asking God to enlarge our territory, we are asking God to create here at Aldersgate a multi-generational church, a place, a sacred space in which people of all ages can come and find family and find fellowship and find Jesus. So please come and walk the labyrinth, asking God to walk with you and asking God what he would have you hear as we embark on our new vision. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, God's people said, Amen.